I'm Pastor Ellie. And I'm Pastor Kurt. We're from Seven Seas Ministries. And welcome to our latest message. This one is called, We Are Accountable. Yes, we are. That's right. <laughs> we're not accountants, we're accountable. <laughs> so we want, we want to talk today about the fact that we are accountable as followers of Christ mm -hmm. for whatever we do. Yes. And that sounds pretty scary. Yes. Because it is. Mm -hmm. But... It's important to be scared. It's important. <laughs> well, the Bible says, the fear, fear of the Lord is the beginning yes, of wisdom. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. <laughs> so, we want to talk about the fact that as believers, as followers of Christ, we are accountable for what we do. Yes. We're accountable for our words, for mm -hmm. our actions. Whatever we do during our lifetimes, we are accountable for. Yes, that's right. And Romans 2.6 mm -hmm. Uh, I'm paraphrasing, because there are like three or four or five different places that say the same or say the same thing, but with different wording. Mm -hmm. But basically, each of us will be rewarded for what we do. Mm -hmm. um, so we need to remember that we are rewarded for what we do based on good or bad. Yes. That's so right. if we do good, God mm -hmm. rewards us with good. Mm -hmm. If we don't do good, He rewards us with not so good. <laughs> so let's let's kind of just talk about that a little yeah. bit. And and you know, we don't really need to give examples of good things and mm -hmm. bad things because mm -hmm. we all know what those are. Mm -hmm. um, but as we live out our lives and we walk this path that mm -hmm. God has us on and each each of us has our own path, everything that we say and do should line up with what God wants. That's right. Not just what He wants for us, but what He wants in general. Mm -hmm. Because God has placed, He has put things in place that mm -hmm. are kind of like universal, uh, whole human, whole world, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> um, things, things that need to play out. Well, right? things that, that need to saying? play out, but more like guidelines for us, okay. like the Ten oh, Commandments. Okay. Yes. Okay. So okay. that's a universal moral code oh, okay. that's what applies to everyone, mm -hmm. not even just believers. Okay. That's a universal moral code. Okay. And so if we, as we grow, if mm -hmm. we're a believer and as we grow and we learn, we should mature. Right. And so the things that we do should line up with what we learn in his word. Mm -hmm. The things that he teaches us should carry out in our own Those, lives. Yes, that's right. And our reward is not what we should be looking for. Right. That's probably the most important part of this mm -hmm. is that, yes, we should live the way he wants us to, mm -hmm. but not to look for rewards. Mm -hmm. Why do we Why do we live the right way? Mm -hmm. Why do we follow God? Right. Well, because we love him. We go. love him and we want to please him. I that's mean, right. that's really mm -hmm. what it sums sums it all up in mm -hmm. a nutshell. Is yeah. that how they say it? Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's right. We do it because we love him. Mm -hmm. You know, Jesus came to earth because he loved his father. He mm -hmm. loves his father. Mm -hmm. And he loves us. Mm -hmm. And what he did, his purpose, and all that he did was because of love. Right. And what we do is... All that we do to serve the Father mm -hmm. is because of love. Right. So everything we do, you know, if we look at it that way and we do what we do because we love Him. Right. You know, the things that we do will will shine through us right. so that others can know that we love Him and we do what we do because of that. Right. Amen. And, 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 amen. and when we do what we do, mm -hmm. we shouldn't do it grumbling about it. That's right. Jesus said that if you love me, follow my commandments. Right. Now, he wasn't talking about the Ten Commandments. He was talking about what he taught while mm -hmm. he was here. Mm -hmm. He was talking about how he set an example for us with his life. Yes. And so as we walk out our lives mm -hmm. as children of God, as followers of Christ, we should also exemplify mm -hmm. and walk out those things that we're taught to walk out. That's right. So if we love him... We should follow him. Yes. We should walk out the mm -hmm. things that we know are right and true. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we can't get hung up on the rewards because if we think about it, the rewards aren't always rewards in the natural. Right. 
we store up treasures based on our actions, mm -hmm. not so much for here on earth, but for eternity. Yes, that's because, right. Amen. Because we will be judged based yes. on what we do. Mm -hmm. And so we, we kind of build up a treasury, I yes. guess. <laughs> a savings account, I don't know. I'm not an accountant, like I said. <laughs> but we can... We know that as we walk this mm -hmm. path and as we live righteously according to the Word of God, we will be rewarded in the end. Yes, that's right. Now, God will reward us at times here, mm -hmm. too, so that when we are in need of things mm -hmm. for our lives, God supplies those things. Yes, that's right. But the key word is need. Right. Not what necessarily what we want, but what mm -hmm. we need. Mm -hmm. And there are a lot of scriptures that go with that. Yes. And I can't think of any of them off the top of my head, of course. But there are scriptures that talk about, He shall supply our every need. Mm -hmm. And so we need to know that what we think we need mm -hmm. may be very different from what we really need. Yes. And God will supply our need mm -hmm. according to His riches and glory. Yes. And I'll put the reference up on the screen for that. But it's important for us to live our lives in that right and proper way. Yes, that's right. And live righteously and let our lives be a light that shines mm -hmm. and shows the glory and the love of God and the compassion and the mercy of God to all those around us. That's right. You know? I think that, you know, in doing that, <clears throat> it's so important that we take one day at a time. Yeah. Because just doing that mm -hmm. is a lot. You know, it's to a focus, job. it is. It's a job. It's a job. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know, I think of you know discipleship. Mm -hmm. You know, and how we need to be his disciples, mm -hmm. and we need to be paying attention yeah. to our teacher mm -hmm. and what he is asking of us to do right. in that moment. Mm -hmm. You know, we can't look like weeks ahead. We need to take no. one day at a time and mm -hmm. just be that disciple that he mm -hmm. wants us to be in that right. moment, mm -hmm. in that hour. So. You know, it's a one day at a time thing yeah. that we need to walk out, mm -hmm. and God will reward us, you know, accordingly. Right. So, you know, we do it because we love Him. Mm -hmm. We do it out of love, but know that He is seeing everything we do. Right. Everything we do, He's watching. And yeah. that's, to me, that's just, that's cool. Yeah. Because, you know, mm -hmm. That keeps us accountable. Yeah. That makes us accountable. Okay, he's exactly. watching me. Yeah. That's going to make me think a little bit harder as yeah. to what I'm, what steps I'm going to take, or what I'm going to say, or right. you know. So it's a, yeah. it's definitely a good reminder. <laughs> yeah, our accountability to God is is what keeps us in line. Yes, Should that's be. right. Yeah. And so if if we're not holding ourselves accountable to God, we need to we need to learn to start. Yes. So that. We're pleasing Him yes, and shining His light and being an example of Him as Jesus walked the earth yes, and, and not the opposite. That's right. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Let's wrap this up and pray. Yes. Father God, we thank You. Thank You, Lord. That You do hold us accountable. Yes. Sometimes we, we may be uncomfortable with that. But let us learn, Father God, that you are right and you are true and everything that you have for us yes. is good. Yes, it is. And Father, teach us to stay accountable to you. Yes, Father. Let us not rebel. Let us not push back against you. And Lord, help transform our hearts and change them so that your desires will become our desires, Lord God. That we would long to follow you in everything that we say and everything that we do. And that we would want nothing but to shine your light on those around us. Yes. That you would be glorified and that you would get the honor. And that what we do and our lives will please you in everything. Yes. And we just thank you that you are faithful. Yes. You are faithful in all things. Mm -hmm. And we just pray in the precious, mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 So let's stay accountable. Yes. For the good things. That's right. <laughs> We're accountable for all of them. Yes. So let's make them all good. Yes. That's good. <laughs> we love you guys. We love you. Thank you so much for your prayers. Yes. And thank you for all that you do. We appreciate it. Yes, we do. And if you would like this and share it and comment on it, <laughs> and don't forget to subscribe. We would greatly appreciate it. Yes. That's it for now. 
You guys take care. And until next time, stay close to God. And we'll talk again soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.